Last year, I promised you guys three intubation tips for beginners. Unfortunately, I never got to the third one. So here is my third and final tip. It's all about positioning. In anesthesia, we like to talk about the head elevated laryngoscopy position. That's when the head is at least four inches off the table for most patients and the head is extended back as long as the patient has no C-spine issues. A helpful trick that I was taught in my training is to line up the tragus, meaning the ear canal, with the patient's sternal notch. When the patient's head is flat against the table, the tragus is typically lying below the level of the sternal notch. You'll notice that when the head comes off the table and is extended back, the tragus and the sternal notch come much more into a straight line with each other, so that's what we're going to try to optimize and demonstrate in this video. I'm going to demo what it's like to try to intubate a dummy while its head is completely flat on the table. You're going to notice I'm struggling a little bit because the rubber dummy itself is very stiff. And when the head is completely flat on the table, I have to struggle very hard and I have a grade two view. This is what the view looks like. I can see the epiglottis. I can see the bottom of the arytenoids. It would be challenging to intubate this patient. Take a look at what happens when I add in one folded up blanket, getting the head about two inches off of the table. I'm still struggling a little bit, but not using quite as much force as before. Here's what the view looks like. It's still not a perfect grade one view, but with just one roll of the blanket, I can see a lot more of the airway than I was able to before. I folded my blanket in half again, so the patient's head is much closer to about four inches off the table height. You're going to see here, I'm having a much easier time intubating using a lot less force. That was my easiest and best view of all. I have a full view of the airway and vocal cords. I have a grade one view that's going to be an easy shot intubation.